I um, so I've just arrived at our fancy restaurant. This morning's vlog is not off to a great start. Woke up and noticed that our rear tire on the scooter was completely flat. To make matters worse, completely out of gas as well. It's like, it's the perfect storm. Luckily, where we were staying in our last villa, we used to drive up and down this little street and you may remember it. It goes like this. The water buffalo hang out there and our old villa, Mr. Stowe's Garden Villa is up there. There's a place here that fixes bikes and we always see them working on stuff. So fortunately, it was only around the road. I've just driven there now. Hopefully it doesn't cost too much. This guy's working on it. We'll see what happens. That is not good. This is the situation right now. I'm sitting in, I think it's pretty much their house. These guys work from here. This is their workshop. My man here has just been pulling out a whole bunch of black gunk from inside the wheel. The whole tube is like ridden off so now he's like taking off the muffler. Going to replace the whole tube which I think is going to be 8 US dollars. Which is reasonable. Consider considering. It just gets weirder. So when I first got here, there was two dudes. First guy spoke quite good English and was able to somewhat translate. And the guy working on the bike, um, it's his shop, uh, English enough to say hello. Anyway, so I've shown you, he's working on it. Everything's all good. They've, they've pulled me up this little seat here <laughs> in their workshop. He's working away and then all of a sudden he gets up, puts some jeans on, still no shirt, jumps on his bike, leaves. I'm just uh, chilling here amongst all the pulled out electronics, carcasses of bikes, dripping oil everywhere. Just, just chilling. This is, this is the Vietnamese way of life. I'm sure I'm, I'm absolutely comfortable. I'm sure it's absolutely fine. It's just, it's just hilarious. He's obviously gone to gri grab some sort of a part or something that he doesn't have. Stay tuned, because I've got no idea how this plays out. So there's our muffler on the floor. I think that's what that's what was holding it together. That's all the crap that came out of it. That is the blow-in tube. And I think there's a new one in here at the moment. It's all completely apart. There's his cleaning cloth and his shirt. And uh, he's gone. Off he goes. <laughs> the hero is back. I think he went to buy a new inner tube. <laughs> the saga continues. Stay tuned. Just like that, she's fixed. That only took, realistically, probably about 15 minutes and the dude had to take it off the wheel, replace the tube, went and bought a new tube, eight US dollars. Maybe I should go and get some gas now to just make sure that nothing else could possibly go wrong. All as well. I've just got back, been briefing Stace on and showing her the, <laughs> the footage. She obviously didn't come along because it makes no sense to have two of us riding on a bike with like a blown out tire. So the plan for today is to hunt out some good quality Vietnamese coffee. The coffee in Vietnam, if you haven't had it before, if you've had it before, you know just how incredible it is. If you haven't had it before, we've talked about it in other vlogs, it's just, it's the most unique tasting coffee I've ever experienced and I'm pretty much addicted to it. So there's a place <laughs> there's a place in town that is like a is it roast roastery? Roastery. And buy some coffee for me so that I can feed my caffeine addiction. This is the spot. Looks like they've got big like canisters of beans and everything. Got a, um, it's, it says that it's Vietnam Deluxe. Okay. 
It's a Vietnam Deluxe Yellow Bourbon. It smells good. the most expensive one on the menu to try. It's nice to be able to smell it and then like five minutes later have it right in front of you. I'm gonna try this. I picked the most expensive one. It's like 20 something US dollars, 500 grams, which I think maybe a little bit too baller for Vietnam. The one I was drinking was only worth like $5. You know, we'll decide. That sequence make you want a coffee? Been back, had a swim. I didn't get the most expensive one. I ended up getting one that was medium quality, apparently. It's still absolutely delicious. I bet you in about five minutes, I'm gonna be like fiending, bouncing off the walls. <laughs> Somebody's getting glammed up. <laughs> this is as glamorous as I got when I always wear with different shoes. <laughs> yeah, that's what I meant. That's what I meant, you're, you're doing up your shoes. It's glamming up totally. <laughs> So we've decided we're gonna do a date night. I'm sure nobody actually really cares too much about what that night looks like. But what we do wanna show is the restaurant that we're going to, because it's one of the top rated ones in, uh, in Hoi An. It's called New Eatery. I'm sure people are gonna get sick of us showing this, but look at the state of that. Pretty lucky. Does it come up well on camera? Yeah, you come up beautifully. <laughs> So we've just arrived at our fancy restaurant. We're just out here pretending like we <laughs> can't take us anywhere. Can't take us seriously anywhere. Um, looks like a cute little garden spot. We're on the beachside, so we're in it uh, back at Umbang Beach. Just get that out of your way. <laughs> so there are a few things that I have heard about that we have to get. One of them is like these little pork buns. Yeah. They look so good. And then there's Dane's favorite, which is some kind of like chicken, chicken, rice, mango. Situation. Talking my language, talking my language. <laughs> <laughs> I'm excited. Sort of, we left dinner already. <laughs> we didn't actually stay out for too long. Um, had a it was a really nice place. The pork pork bun. The pork buns was well, so good. It was like off the charts tasty. Probably the best we've had in a really long time, and quite well priced as well for what you get. Um, but we've been craving this. Was it caramel? Caramel walnut cake. We decided we'd come home, heat these up, munch on some uh, dessert, and watch a movie. Exciting! Which is exciting for us, but really f***ing boring for you guys. So, <laughs> I think we'll end it here. Thanks again for watching. Bye from me. Bye from me. See you later! Yeah.